Maybe the Easter Bunny will bring you a charcuterie board. Hmm. All aboard Candy in Center City uh, wants to help out the Easter Bunny. Mm -hmm. So we're going to show you just a few of their creations. Wow. Look at that. The colors, the design. That's taking it up. Uh, many notches for the bunny. Mm -hmm. Charcuterie candy boards, Jen. We want to see more. Um, I know. They're awesome. Good morning, ladies. Good morning. Okay, so this was sort of a COVID project for you guys? Sort of a COVID project, an idea that came before COVID, um, but we had to do, you know, a little pivot just while there was a lot of restrictions happening and people kind of, you know, not necessarily wanting everyone touching their food. Um, but now, you know, we're here. We're excited. We are a candy charcuterie company, also known as a candy board. Okay, so talk to me. You are the more, um, you need everything detailed. <laughs> you, you're the non-messy one, yes. right? So what is this right here? So this is our sampler, which just allows a larger portion of candy in a smaller space. So it's neat, it's organized, we do them by themes. So we did this really fun Easter one, we did a super fun one for Valentine's Day, and they're really pretty and they're almost like a really nice coffee table piece. That, yeah, you could definitely have them there. And then you're kind of like, let's go crazy, let's go wild. So I like it messy. I like someone to get this board and be like, oh my God, where do I look first? Which piece do I eat first? Almost like it's too pretty to touch, I don't even want to touch it. And okay, talk, do the flipperoo on that one, okay. because you can send them, Mm -hmm. you, you do very little chocolate, right? Very little chocolate. Um, we shrink wrap and heat seal all the boards. So shipping chocolate is, you know, difficult as is with temperatures, but because we heat seal it, we try to keep all of our chocolate wrapped. Okay. And then on the flip side is it's really pretty on the bottom because yep. it's all gummy on the bottom. Yes. How so this is Emily's cute. trick. All right, way to go. And then I like the little tongy things because you're supposed to like be good about not touching. Yeah, so since these boards are so large and we want everyone to make sure they can get a little piece, the tongs are really good so you can take what you want and kind of social, socially distance appropriately. Yeah. You said this was huge like this summer in Margate. Yes. Who, yes. who was ordering this type of thing? So these were great for, you know, birthday parties, graduations, everything had to move outdoors. And this was just a really great piece to have for friends and family and it just, you know, looks amazing. Okay, let's go over here to where the magic happens. So <laughs> I love, you said one of your biggest ones was um, engagement boards. Yes, so a lot of people, you know, there was a lot of missed celebrations this year. People were not able to have traditional engagements, bridal showers, weddings. So a lot of people were ordering our candy boards to send as a congratulatory gift. Um, and we always like to top them with you know these cute little bride and groom lollipops um, we also have little cake lollipops that we aren't sharing today um, but that's kind of you know another little trick in our book if you will i love it okay and i also love you guys go out of your way to find weird but awesome custom candies yes it's probably our most favorite thing to do we love mm -hmm. the unexpected shapes so you'll see we have flowers unicorns our sneakers those are super fun the sharks um, and we've multicolored unicorns that we didn't bring up today, but those are like the fun ones, you know. People basically will say to you, my daughter really likes mermaids mm -hmm. that are yellow, and you guys can go find that somewhere. Oh, for sure. Yes. People send mood boards, they send favorite colors, favorite shapes, pictures, favorite wait behavior patterns. It's crazy. What? Wait, what? Oh, yeah. Behavior patterns? Yeah, like what this person mean? likes to dance, this person likes to play soccer. You oh, know? okay. All right, but what yeah. about the mood board? Someone's sending mood. a mood board for their charcuterie board? Yes, and that sort of just helps us inspire our vision and, you know, really helps our creative process and what colors they like. Okay, and what real pattern. quick. Is the mood board via email? Like they have it in there, like, yeah, she's saying yes. <laughs> yes. It's, it's all the platforms. Am I a jerk that I don't have a mood board, like, just to <laughs> send to people? I mean, if you didn't have a mood board for your daughter's birthday party, she might. She might not get yes. her vision. Let's say, <laughs> I, okay, call, call the authorities because I am the worst mom in the world. I did not have a mood board for my 11 year old. Nope. But it came yeah. out beautiful still. No, Mike, you know, Child well, everyone knows that place. Landry Frederick is Mike Jarek's favorite Frederick. I love her. Correct? <laughs> yep. Yeah. If you don't order one of these things for her, I'm going to tell her Uncle Mike doesn't care. What's her favorite candy, <laughs> Landry? Oh, yeah. Do you know? So, yeah. Landry loves, I have to say this, Landry loves nonpareils, and they actually have a gummy with nonpareils on it. Oh. She, her favorite thing, though, is York peppermint patties. She calls them Yorks. Ooh, Yorks. Yeah. Those right. are really popular. Those are yes. really popular. People really like these. They're cherry in the center. Oh. Um, they're really good. And they're very delicious. All right, have yes. them make up a customized board for uh, Landry. Those are I'll pick up the tag. Okay. 
Mike's going to pay for a customized. Yeah. Yeah. So here's what we're really going to do. Well, I know we're going to say it's for Landry, but I want the booze gummies. She's going to order <laughs> yeah, a the size gummies. of an aircraft carrier <laughs> and charge my credit card. <laughs>